Hey guys, Monaco here. Um, I just wanted to make a video showcasing how you can get the uh, chroma key background on your webcam through uh, the new AMD um, Relive software. Now, just a little background here. Um, I'm sure a lot of you want to know this because when people are, are streaming, you know, they tend to use OBS, which is fine. It's a really good product. And they set it up with the chroma key and it does its whole thing. And, and the problem is, is it, it uses so much CPU power. Um, on, on my computer alone, at the settings I had it, I, I, I clocked it at uh, around, around 30 to 40% depending on what game I was playing and at the time I was is Fallout 4 I was I was screwing around with just testing some stuff out and um, the Fallout 4 itself was at 40% and OBS was at another 30-40% so I mean your CPU is just it's in there like a Tasmanian devil just getting hot so I started thinking you know you know, I, had, I just got a uh, new AMD card and uh, downloaded the new software and I, I was reading about the relive um, being able to, to stream and using your graphics card from what I understand to to make it do all the work um, and taking that that burden off of your CPU so that you don't lose any frames or uh, you know tax your system any more than you have to so I kind of I played around with it um, I have my my system set up basically for the for this whole thing to work you're gonna need two screens um, running off the same computer because um, you know if you're if you're using OBS and you have a separate computer to do the encoding then you're fine you're you're not losing any 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 frames because basically that computer doing all the work so this is for a single computer uh, gaming computer something decent it's gonna have to be actually it might not even have to be decent but anyways you need the main screen for your game and the second screen basically is where your 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 radio is going to be and I'm going to show you how it's going to work. So let's get to it. Basically this is how I have it set up. Okay, It's on, recording the desktop, record the desktop. That's a big thing. Uh, save folder, whatever you want. Video capture device. This is for the streaming part. Um, audio capture, your microphone. Uh, you can go through all these, look at the hotkeys. Um, I use them, you know, just the two, the recording and then the, uh, the streaming. And I stream straight to Twitch. So, um, streaming, uh, Twitch, you know, blah, 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 blah. I have it on Ultra because I'll tell you what, I looked at this testing when I tested it with Fallout 4 and I was using 5% of the CPU, just 5% streaming on Ultra 1080. I looked at it on my Twitch. It looks beautiful. It sounds beautiful. And I don't take any hit on the, the game itself. So, you know, do whatever you want, play around with it, you'll get it to where you want. But this is just to show you how to get it to show up with the chroma key. So basically what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to get OBS up and running. Um, I'm going to drag it in now and you'll see. Get OBS running and uh, there I am. Basically you're going to want to do the preview mode. Because preview is gonna, still, it's gonna preview the game you're playing. Um, I have some Strexum stuff up here. Um, basically, just the name of you know the various social media things that I'm doing now. If any of you guys try to go to these, there's probably not a ton of stuff on there because it's fairly new. Um, I'm not new at this, but I decided to make new accounts on all my social media just to a clean slate. 2017 resolutions. Um, but anyways. The, the downfall to this is on Strexum, you know, they have bars on top or wherever you want to put them, social media boxes, chat boxes and stuff, follower alerts, blah, blah, blah. It won't work in preview mode. I tried it. Um, so that, that's the only downfall. But this is basically just so you get the background you want and you can stream and have some information up there and have a live channel and get out there and do your thing. So you see it's working. Here I am. Um, it's in preview mode. The game's paused. I have it on my other screen over over here. Um, so, in the in the settings, what you're going to want to do because it, it will the preview mode will tax your system if 
in the in the advanced tab you're going to want to disable encoding while previewing that's huge because otherwise it's going to encode and you're going to see these big numbers down here bottom right corner uh, it's going to be encoding your preview you disable it hit apply and there you go now when this preview thing is running I'm going to drag over my my CPU thing here you see Fallout 4 is it, it's not using anything right now because it's just I have it minimized broadcaster 1.1% um, my relive right now is at 3.8 because um, I'm recording so uh, I can't really stream and record at the same time um, I can but for some reason the the relive is not it's not connected to my YouTube so I'll have to figure that out but basically now you can just hit you know your your hotkey for for streaming control shift G and it will it will stream and Fallout 4 will be, you'll see it here, I'm just going to, and, uh, and how much uh, everything else goes up too. So, uh, Fallout, okay, see so yeah, that jumps up to 30% um, or so, maybe a little bit higher. And then uh, OBS, 0.9%, so under percent AMD, I'm just recording it right now um, with you guys. And it is basically at 5%. So, you know, I can... So if I come back over here, if I if I do this, if I if I take this, and uh, when you stream, an important thing is, because you just saw that it just, it just streams the monitor, uh, a huge thing to do is, if, you know, right-click, full screen preview mode. So there you go. This is what your stream is going to look like. This screen right here, no borders, no nothing, okay? you, your info, and the game. Um, basically, this is what it's going to be. Uh, you know, watch it, watch it for a second. Tell me what you think. Um, you know, you're not losing any frames. Um, I'm getting, I don't know if you can really see it behind that uh, icon up there, but uh, I, I think I have it tapped out at 60, but um, if, I, if I drop the, the fence there, it'll it'll pop up to 110, you know, 120 easily. So, and that, uh, it's with running, you know, and, and what right now, if I took this, I'm going to put it to YouTube. This is the, the video I end up with. Um, nice, nice resolution. Um, it's fast. I'm not getting any lag whatsoever. Um, so that's that. And then you see, um, when I exit full screen mode, you see basically, you saw it. I was at 0.9% on the broadcasting. I think I just jumped up to one, but. Um, you know, 30% for the game, which is normal. And then uh, Relive was, I think it was probably around 5% when I was playing. So um, there you go. If you guys have any questions, um, feel free to ask. I will be monitoring the, the YouTube channel. Um, so um, ask away and uh, subscribe or follow or share the video. I think it's kind of important because, you know, not everybody ha has the money to 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 buy another PC that's just as good as the one they spent you know thirteen hundred dollars on or whatever to build um, just to, to stream because you know there's no money in it not you know not right away not for a lot of people that you know a lot of people just want to do it for fun or, or to give it a try get their name out there and showcase some of their abilities um, so this is a workaround um, I'm sure AMD is going to be adding a lot of stuff in the future because this is really cool it's really um, takes down on the on the burden of, of the entire uh, of the whole encoding process that OBS does now maybe someday OBS will figure this out but right now I think they have gold and uh, a lot of people choose AMD I choose AMD I've always had them um, not that there's anything wrong with NVIDIA obviously you know if the benchmarks are all true NVIDIA is a better card you know whatever they're one step ahead but for cost performance wise I think AMD has always been a leader and I have never had issues with them they've always performed um, yeah so I think that they got something here and I think uh, I hope I hope help, help some people out so um, feel free to uh, to you know, you know 
know, get in contact with me, you see the uh, the info over here. Um, Twitter. I don't really use Twitter too much. Just tell people I'm going live. Um, YouTube or Monaco. I'm going to change that. It's going to be uh, Monaco. Um, I think uh, underscore gaming for the uh, YouTube and then uh, Instagram. So my uh, the email, if you guys have questions, is uh, Monaco dot gaming at outlook dot com. Um, otherwise, just uh, subscribe to the, the YouTube channel and and uh, you know share it with your friends. Hope this all helped. You guys have a good day, good night, whatever.